Yeah. Now at five, a manhunt underway after a Los Angeles County Sheriff's deputy is ambushed, shot and killed while in his patrol car. We're live with the latest. A teenage firefighter in training is involved in a devastating accident, leaving her with significant injuries. How the community is coming together to aid in her recovery. And Governor Newsom is announcing plans to sign a pair of trailblazing climate bills mandating corporations be more transparent about greenhouse gas emissions. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the News at 5. I'm Rick Chen. And I'm Kareem Winter. We begin with the tragic ambush killing of an L.A. County Sheriff's deputy. Tonight, a reward has been offered for information on the person who shot and killed Deputy Ryan Klinkenberg. Now we've got live team coverage of that deadly killing. Uh, Carlos Aceto, re reaction rather from the community. But we want to begin with Rachel Menetoff, who joins us live from Palmdale. Well, Sheriff Luna just gave an update on the investigation. Rachel. Rick Kareem, good evening to you both. Sheriff Robert Luna says his department is working around the clock to find the suspect or suspects responsible for this unprovoked attack. He says it could be one person or it could be two. And today he also announced a $250,000 reward for information that leads to an arrest and conviction. The LA County Sheriff